Ah. Ah. Hello, why are you so burnt out, man? That's why. Just came back from the grocery store. Got all these goodies. Tiki punch. Shit in here. The mass rooms. The mass rooms. Down here, up here. Yeah, so I was pushing this stuff here, and uh, and um, I was thinking of like uh, remember Conan the Barbarian, the first one, when he's sitting there pushing the thing in circles, some cheese, some meat. Yeah, so I'm thinking of pushing that. What else in here? Creamer. Crap loads of steak, steak things. Alcohol. Some meat. Butter. Soup. Sugar plates. Rigatoni. Rigaroni. White Castle. Yeah, man. It's 210 bucks for all this. Yep, that's why. That's okay. Put this away and then uh, get something to eat and then we're gonna head to the training. Hey, what's up, YouTube? Welcome to another cooking show, cooking video. Cooking with Lo. Today, uh, yeah, the, I got, that was yesterday I got at the grocery store. I'm good now, that was yesterday, so I got all my energy back. Went skateboarding and everything. So today we're gonna be making some rigatoni. Yeah. And some prego. Yeah, we got a big bottle because uh, my wife loves, uh, she wants lots of it. And a whole pack of sausages. All right, let's go. Let's go do this. All right, first things first. Pretty simple meal. I mean, you know, light up our light. And that one's not on. It's not on because we didn't turn it on. Now it's on. It's on like Donkey Kong, baby. This down a little bit. Yeah, man. So. uh to be the same thing, you know, same, uh, same, same crap, same, uh, whatever. Never really, uh, been cooking. I mean, I've been cooking, but not, uh, you know, nothing like, I think it takes, uh, 15 minutes or something to put the crap on, I don't know. What do I know, man? So yeah, man. So gonna. Some people like to uh, wash these things a couple of times. I don't know. But this is um one box, which is uh, don't know how many. One pound. One pound. There you go. They should put more water, huh? She ain't working. She ain't working. Ground beef. Oh, I had it on the top shelf. That's why they're frozen. Dang it. Frozen because I had it on the top shelf of the fridge. Not good. Not good at all. And this is uh can't see anything. 
this is um, I don't know how much this is. If I can open it, uh, come on. It's got out of dialysis. Been a little wiki wiki. So this is uh, how big is that? Sixteen ounces, I guess. So this is a uh, seventy-three. 27. You want a lot of meat? I don't know. Like meat. But, you know. These days, some people might get offended because, uh, you know. A lot of people going veg vegetarian, you know. Yeah, I can't go vegetarian because. You know, I'm on dialysis, so. Uh, Um, so, you know, my doctor says, uh, you know, if you've been eating meat, if you've been eating meat all your life, it's not good to not eat meat, you know. Open the window a little bit. Yeah. So, just like with my uh, my brother, he uh, my brother he smoked a lot, you know. And uh, so it's cool to quit smoking, you know. So then it turns out. Like three or four of his friends freaking die because they quit. And all those doctors, all those doctors told my brother the same thing, you know? They went to like another doctor, like a Chinese doctor, and he said, no, you gotta have at least. This has been smoking over like shit, man. At least fifty years he's been smoking. So the doctor told him yes, have at least you know two, three, two, three cigarettes a day. So he was living in New York City. And I don't know if you know anything about New York City about cigarettes. It probably cost almost like twenty dollars now. For uh, I could be wrong. I don't know. I don't smoke. Well, at least fifteen dollars a pack. You know, because already here with the marble is ten bucks here in California. So, um, but yeah. So what he did was uh, all his family moved to uh, North Carolina. So he would make a trip down there and then uh, get like you know. Get like six months or years worth, you know. Yeah, that sucks. This thing is frozen because uh, I had it on the freaking top shelf, man. But whatever. This gonna eventually melt. So yeah, so that's what happened, man. So getting back to the meat eating. Yeah. So my doctor, my doc, my doctor, my doctor is India, right? You know a lot of India people, uh, they, you know, vegetarian. A lot of them believe in not killing, you know, killing stuff. So, the vegetarian. But he knows that Asian people can't do that because, first of all, <laughs> I was a vegetarian. In the refugee camp, not by choice, you know? They had no meat over there. So yeah, I was a vegetarian, not by choice. So, so that's what we gotta do, man. 
think it takes uh, 451 right now, so I think it takes uh, for a couple minutes to cook that and then do it. So anyway, yeah, I've been cooking because I've been just skateboarding, man. For a while, I was just playing video games, and uh, I realized that uh, my uh, my health was going down. Not going down, but I was like, don't have as much energy because uh, you know, sitting around, clicking on the mouse and keyboard all day, playing like. 10 to 20 hours a day playing video games. 10 because if I have dialysis, but if I'm dialysis, I play like shit from some like sometimes like uh shit like eight in the morning till shit. I don't mean, who knows. Who knows? Try to boot up my computer real quick. I was going to uh, change the, um, install the hard drive because I got a new hard drive. I have a couple hard drives, but uh, I need one for uh, to put my games on because you know put all my games on. Because right now I have the SD card, SSD card for the main computer. And I only saw like two games on it. I didn't put any games on it. So now that I have a body, uh, I'll show you two later in a little bit. But anyway, it's a two terabyte Western, uh, you know. I don't know what those colors mean, but I got a yellow one. It was on sale for $52, man. Pretty good. I ordered it like, shit, two days ago. And it came today, so pretty cool, man. Right? So that way I don't have to worry about like you know what game I should download because if you have the epic, uh, epic, um, whatever uh, launcher, you get free games every Thursday. Most of them are like indie games, you know, not really uh, like probably out of twenty games. You might get like one good game, like Metro or something, you know. But then sometimes if you get like a Ubisoft or some other game from other company, you have to have their launchers too. So I don't, I don't install that shit. Just I don't really care about like a Ubisoft or Electronic Art and shit like that, you know. So then, um. Yeah, for last year till about uh, last year 2020 till about this year 2021, I uh, around January, I was riding my skateboard to dialysis. You know, when I have dialysis, and uh, well, before that, I was riding my um. Okay, the way it started was my friend. He would tell me like, oh yeah man, I did like 12 miles today on my bike, you know. You ride like 12 miles a day on his bike. So then, um, so they crashed, they crashed my truck and then I got a bike, or two bikes. One got stolen out of the carport. And then, uh, so then, uh, like not even like three months and then I got another one so I have that one now and uh So this is the one I'm riding now, the red line, right there. Pull inside now so we don't get that shit stolen. Oh yeah, I've been collecting some skateboards. Couple. <laughs> There's all my Yu-Gi-Oh stuff, There's some game stuff. Yeah, some more skateboards. Yeah, one over here by the fridge.
running out of wall. <laughs> and uh, yeah, so anyway, my friend he was riding uh, his bike, you know. I mean, really like motivated. Start riding my bike. And I would ride it to like when I was playing Yu Gi Oh! And then, uh, so I'd ride to Anaheim, you know, about 12 miles or so. First time I rode down there on my bike, it took me like three hours, man. Took a break like three times, at least. So that was probably like a year or two, a year and a half or two years ago. Probably a year and a half ago. And then after that, I was, every week I was riding and I was getting stronger and stronger, you know. And then, uh, and then I was still wasn't riding my skateboard. I was just playing games. Cause uh, yeah, I didn't play games for a while. I mean, uh, ride my skateboard for a while. I wasn't uh, I wasn't uh, you know, I wasn't um, interested, you know. So. Um, Hold on a second. Get my wife wants. All right, so got get all these uh, liquid out of here. A lot of liquid. That's how the uh, the meat looks so big, you know, when uh, you get them. But a lot of it is water. water and fat. So anyway, yeah, I started riding my uh, bike and everything and I was, going, I was getting a little stronger but not as strong as I, you know. I wasn't really, uh, you know, looking to get stronger and you know, I was just riding. I figure as long as I'm moving, you know. So I was still playing my game, on my bike to the pharmacy and things like that, and just walking to, uh, to dialysis. And then, uh, and then around last year, uh, around January, I mean this year, around January, I had this, this, like, itch man I was like oh man I had this feeling like you know like I wanted a skateboard you know let me move some of this stuff out real quick yeah so I was like oh man it's like oh I want to skate you know So, uh, I usually use the walk, but, um, obviously we need that for the, for the rigatoni. So, uh, yeah, around January, I started getting this, like, feeling like when I first started skateboarding in, like, 1985, man. Like, I wanted, like, wanted it, you know? Get the best feeling. So then after that, I started riding my skateboard to dialysis. Just here and there. I mean, I'd walk a lot of times because I didn't have enough, you know, stamina. So. Yeah, I would try to ride it. But then uh, around March, when I turned 50 on my birthday, you know, I was thinking, thinking to myself, you know, because I love to play Yu-Gi-Oh! and I love to play video games, and I love skateboarding. So I told myself, hey man, you know, like, 
jack of all trades, master of none, you know? Not saying that I'm a master of any of them, but, uh, so I, uh, I decided to pick one. And, uh, so I picked, um, yeah, I picked the uh, skateboarding, you know? So then I made these videos all uh, training. Skateboard training. I ride about two hours a day at the park across the street. And then, uh, and so as of yesterday, I, uh, more number 12. So I rode uh, Monday, I mean Tuesday, Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday and Sunday. So, uh, so four video is, um, so you figure four videos one week. So I'm at number 12. So yeah, I mean, uh, so I'm three weeks in now. Yeah. And very, very, uh, very stoked on it, you know, like getting stronger. You know, plus I'm stretching like at least uh, 30 minutes every morning. You know. And uh, yeah, my stamina, like today, I rode back on my skateboard. I could feel the difference, man. Like, I usually get tired pretty easy. Especially after dialysis, you know. But today I was like, okay, yeah, feels pretty good. Yeah. Alright, I'm gonna cook this. Uh, we're gonna pause. I'm gonna, gonna cook this and then we'll uh, if I have another story or something, we'll come back. Alright, we're almost done with this. Got the grease out of it and then uh taste one of these bad boys, see if it's cooked. So it's 51. In 17 minutes. I think we could cook it just a little bit more. I'm just gonna the juice out of it. What I usually do is I just soak it up with the um with the towel. That way we don't clog up the sink, you know. It will bring this one over here. Turn the other one off. Or you can uh, soak it up the rest of it. Then we can soak up the sink down here, you know, that I put in there. I wasn't thinking. I haven't cooked for a long time. Something worse than clog sink, you know. So we're good. Yeah. Cook it for another like five minutes, I guess. I'm sure there's ways to cook this. You know, some people probably like uh. Oh, I don't know. You know, try ways to add stuff, salt and all that. But you're gonna get plenty of salt from the the uh, Italian sausage, you know. Let's cook this for another five minutes, and we'll come back. So I turned the turn the fire up so we can put more water.
that black probably probably had bugging behind it's black. That's from the um because it needs the from the frying from the frying the tin. Some people would um dump this water out first and then put new ones. I don't know. Whatever I mean. My sister <laughs> one of my sisters said, yeah yeah and all that chemical man when I make my ramen I dump all that out and it's all muddy and shows you all the chemicals but okay, anyway <laughs> I said yeah I don't know I said it's probably from the you know the flour or whatever it is just like my other sister she says to rinse the rice out a bunch of times but I don't like wasting things we'll come back all right, <clears throat> so probably all together, I would say like 30 minutes, I think, that I boiled it. Just get that extra softness, you know. That's why. Don't really know that's gonna be. I don't think it's gonna fit. Oh well. What can do? What can do if it doesn't fit? Yes. But there's a wheel, there's a way. goodies back in So this is four pounds. <laughs> four pounds of sauce. Get the rest of it. I put a little bit of water. Bring it up a little bit. No point to waste it, you know. She loves her some sauce. As you can see. So that thing is Sixty-seven ounces. So sixty-four is four pounds. So yeah, three ounces. Four pounds, three ounces is sixty-seven ounces. Okay. Good to know. It's always good to learn, you know. Do you have to second guess it? Let's 
Wow, it's a lot of rigatoni. My palm is not sinking. That's good enough. Turn the fire off. I'm sure there's a way to turn this crap. Problem is I wanna take my time, I don't wanna make a mess. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? Like you get this on your clothes and stuff and stuff, it's gonna stain you know? Yeah. Can't have that, right? So, uh, here I got a bunch of trays, you know, you make that much food, can't eat all that, you know. Can't eat all that food. So you do, you freeze it. You know, that way you can uh, So you just squeeze it. So you do this uh, You just do like... Whatever you want, two scoops, three scoops, I mean... You know, it's up to you. I mean, two, three smaller, three bigger scoops. Maybe another. Of course, we have a, uh, you know, a, a weight thing to like measure. You know, who has a freaking weight scale? Oh, that's heavy. So just do this. So we'll have to use the left hand. Make sure you don't drop this. The pot, I mean. <laughs> I have done that before. I had. I was making a. Uh, I was making a uh, pitcher of Kool Aid. I'll freaking drop the picture, man. That took a while to clean up. So, I mean, this is... I think this is cheaper than buying... You know... You know, five TV dinners, right? You know? I mean, you could buy five TV dinners. TV dinners come with these sizes. Whoa! Get back, Jack. These sizes, you know, smaller than that. See? Actually, by making your own stuff, you get more. Of course, you don't have preservatives like the, you know, like the TV dinner. Okay. The reason I'm not eating that much is because I've been chomping on it off and off on on and off camera so yeah I'm pretty pretty full man you know
front of the last one. That last one didn't get anything. All right, then we're gonna clean that later. So uh, I'm gonna bring it over here. I mean, you could put like Parmesan cheese stuff like that. We got the, yeah, we got the. We got two kinds. We got the generic. Roman no and we got the fancy one Stella Stella yeah so let's see what the I don't know I'm not a pudding though <laughs> So a beverage we could drink coke water Tiki, which is punch with the uh, combination of generic co cherry cola. If I drink a Fanta, Fanta. No Fanta is like in Laos, I think. So yeah, more Fanta in here. Yeah. In Laos is like a fancy, you know. Gotta have money to be drinking this stuff. Not when you're a kid like myself. See, we got a bunch, my Wi-Fi bunch from Amazon. Yeah, but we just keep rewashing them. So you can see we got, uh, you know, let me just put the lid on it. Wow, it's pretty heavy. Way heavier than the thing you buy. So, uh, this one usually is skateboarding with low. When usually you find me. So there's my training video that was yesterday. And uh, before then I was playing these. These are the only two games that I have installed. Those games. Or oh, five games. If you look at this game, Look how many hours play. 1,176 hours, 49 minutes. I was playing that game. <laughs> All right. So yeah, that's where you find me. If you, you know, I mean, if you're interested, but so I'm concentrating on a skateboarding. You know. So anyway, I got my. Uh, this hard drive here was on sale. $52 for 2 gigs, pretty good. So that way I don't have to um, keep, uh, you know, keep like deleting my games and stuff, you know. I think that's it. Oh, it's a green one. Let's open it up. Got this uh, anti static. Anyway, it's just a uh, regular. You know, it's not an SSD, it's just a regular. So I guess everyone's trying to get rid of these because, you know, it's old school now, you know. Oh, they didn't even come with a wire. I need that wire. I should have ordered, I didn't know it didn't come with a wire. That sucks. So I don't know if I could put it on because I don't have any, uh, I don't know if I have any uh, SATA wire. Upside down, yes, it is. Yeah, so two terabyte. Now we can get the put the game in. Don't no worry about it. Damn, that sucks. 
If I know that he gave me a SATA wire, I would have ordered one. I wish they would tell you, you know? Oh well. What can do? Anyway. Got that. We got a Fanta. That's it, man. Thanks for watching, you know? Mmm. Pretty good. Go out and try it, man. Alright, thanks for watching. See you guys next time. Enjoy, alright?